Good morning. It's the uh, 4th of June and we're loading logs. This is the easy way. Anyways, I'll bring you back later. Well, this is the second load. I think we're going to end up with four, so uh, we shall see how it develops. Uh, David is making short work of loading them. It's a lot easier than doing it by hand. Later, people. And there we are, loaded with the second trip. A lot of lumber here. Uh, it's going to cost me a small fortune to get it all milled, but uh, yeah, a lot of lumber. And boy, I like loading them with that thing. I've always done it by hand before. It would have taken me a week. Anyways, later, people. Twenty foot six inches and heavy, very heavy. I better go help. Walmart two years ago, and it's hurting. Anyways, yes, I've got a cheap camera. And I've got a big load of logs that are heading out. Yay! David's going to track the machine back to my place to unload and uh, come back with a drag to smooth things out. I did promise the owner we would leave things neat and tidy. And uh, we're done. And I get to drive a Jetta back. Yay! Anyways, later people. Okay, we are at my place now. David is uh, going to stack the logs nice and neat so they will be easy to roll out and get on the mill. And uh, we still have to unload. But, uh, so we're going to be here a while yet. Anyways, I'm having a good day. Later, people. And there we go, all stacked up nice and pretty, ready for uh, me to bring my sire in. Yay! And we still got plenty of time I'm left on the hour meter of the machine for what I've paid for, so uh, we're going to go dig a well. Yay! I'll meet you over there. So this is the uh, hole I started digging by hand. Uh, David says in an hour he can be down to 12 feet, so uh, yeehaw. He's creeping the machine down the hill. Things are looking good. Anyways, I'll bring you back when we start digging later. And we are digging. Of course, there are uh, a plethora of rocks, which is what made it so blessed difficult to do by hand, but uh, this thing's going to make short work of it. Anyways, uh, we're going to keep digging and I'll bring you back later. Well, real hard going. Water is coming in pretty quick now. Uh, he's making progress. I want the washing machine so bad. Later, people. Well, the water is really coming in. Big pile of castings. But, uh, yay! I'm excited. I think I picked a good spot. Uh, we're down a little over eight feet now, trying for ten, which is uh, the maximum depth for the machine. And uh, David just cannot keep ahead of the water, so uh, it's really coming in. This is a good thing. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have running water. Yay! Running water. Anyhow, later, folks. Oh, okay. This is uh, the area that's going to be the chicken run. Uh, David uh, chainsawed it the other day, just cut and drop. We knew the machine was coming in, so now he's just sort of uh, cleaning up. Uh, the pen will be 50 by 50. Uh, we're just tossing the brush to the outside. It will uh, decompose by itself. Uh, I can grab bits and pieces of it to make uh, rabbit shelters and stuff, but uh, yeah. Get this done and I think we'll call it a day.
it's uh, like 20 after 6. So uh, it's been a long day, folks. But got a lot done. He loves that machine. <laughs> Anyways, later. Well, it's about 7.30. Uh, we started at 8 this morning. David is just headed home. Uh, we got a lot of this scraped down. I think that's all we're going to get done this weekend. It's supposed to be uh, quite rainy tomorrow. So uh, I feel good about this. Uh, I had him dig four holes for me for the two pear trees and the two apple trees. Uh, weather permitting, if I can get a chance between the downpours tomorrow, I will plant them. Uh, I'm tired. Anyways, it's the journey, not the destination. Try to enjoy it. Icky out.